Hello guys, welcome to another video of Circuit Digest. In this video, I will show you how you can use a MQ sensor to measure gas in PPM. So the sensor that I am using here is MQ137 which is used to measure ammonia. But the same procedure can be applied to any MQ sensors to measure any gas like carbon dioxide or even uh, LPG, alcohol, anything that you deserve can be measured with an MQ sensor by using the right series number. Here the 137 series number is used to measure ammonia. So the complete code and how the calibration should be done, how to choose your load resistor, how to use the data sheet, everything along with the circuit diagram and the code can be found at the link given in the description of the video. In this video I will just show you how the project is working. So here after you upload the code you will have an LCD to verify the project which will display the voltage and the value of ammonia in PPM. Right now uh, actually in atmosphere the level of PPM in, of ammonia should be less than 1 but I just played with some ammonia gas inside this environment so we are having a value of 1.3 or 1.2 something and to, in order to prepare ammonia we are using two chemicals. One is aluminium, ammo, sorry, ammonium chloride and the other is sodium hydroxide. So these two salts when mixed together inside water will generate ammonia gas. Now I already collected the ammonia gas inside this test tube. So let me open this test tube and bring it close to the sensor and check if the value of ammonia is getting changed. Right now we have 1.22 and as you can see the value is slowly increasing since the gas is in reach with the sensor and it has boosted all the way up to 20.5 21.7 ppm which is a very high value of ammonia and since i have reduced it the sensor is again picking up the value of ammonia in the atmosphere which is gradually getting dissolved into this atmosphere and uh, you can see the values are getting reduced. So this is how you can use an MQ sensor. It's a very useful sensor provided you know how to use it. So I hope this tutorial would be very much helpful for people who are trying to measure gas in ammonia, sorry gas in PPM using Arduino. So that's it guys. Thanks for watching.